observed as World Environment Day. United Nations announced Go Wild for Life as the theme for the year 2016. The booming illegal trade in wildlife products is eroding Earth's precious biodiversity, robbing us of our natural heritage and driving coal species to the brink of extinction. The killing and smuggling <coughs> is also undermining economies and ecosystems, fueling organized crime and feeding corruption and insecurity across the globe. Wildlife crime endangers iconic elephants, rhinos, tigers, gorillas, and sea turtles. In 2011, a subspecies of Javan rhino went extinct in Vietnam, while the last western black rhinos vanished from Cameroon the same year. Great apes have disappeared from Gambia, Burkina Faso, Benin and Togo and other countries could quickly follow. Lesser known victims include helmeted hornbills and pangolins as well as wild orchids and timbers like rosewood. Sounds surprising. Yes. Flowers and timber are also considered wildlife. Huge efforts to counter the illicit trade, including stronger policies, awareness campaigns, and investments in community conservation and law enforcement have scored some great successes. However, many species remain at risk and it will take a dedicated and sustained effort by each and every one of us to turn the tide. How can we do it? More people need to understand the damage this illicit business is doing to our environment, livelihoods, communities and security. and behavior so that demand for illegal wildlife products falls. at the national or global level. 
many local extinctions will eventually add up to a global extinction. Whoever you are and wherever you live, show zero tolerance for the illegal trade in wildlife in word and deed and make a difference.